Hey there, what's up you guys? It's Fang Shadows here, and today I'm gonna react to the trailer for the Titan series. I'll, I've been hearing a lot of things here and there, good and bad about this, but I wait until I try to see the trailer myself. So, um, <laughs> this will be interesting. Uh, the, the video will be in the description below, check it out. Let's get in this sucker. <laughs> Three, two, one, boop! The following is rated TV MA. <laughs> oh, welcome to the circus. Who are you? Everything led me here. To you. You're the boy from the circus. You got no place to hide. And I'm feeling like a villain, got a hunger inside. Please, can you help me? Madness, madness. Where's Batman? Uh, oh, okay. Fuck Batman. Yep, I heard that line. There's something evil okay. inside of me. You're scared. I get it, but you can control it. <laughs> boy. You don't know what I've become. <laughs> okay. Sometimes, when I feel the darkness, it feels good. My mom. Says there's no such thing as monsters. I used to think that. I was wrong. Madness, madness. Okay. All right. Is that it? Yeah, pretty much. Right. There's been a lot of points and arguments. Like, is it gonna be good? Is it gonna be shit? Oh boy, fucking Christ. Like, a lot of people saying they're gonna accept as it is, because it is different from what we've originally been shown as characters like Dick Grayson, Starfire, Raven, Beast Boy. But I, maybe it's a different interpretation, like Gotham was a different interpretation of the characters, possibly. Um, from the costumes of the actual main characters, Robin looked alright. Raven looked alright, kind of. Beast Boy and Starfire, on the other hand, they can use some changes. Just saying. Because, like, in the posters, Beast Boy didn't look exactly green. Like, he had green hair, but he didn't have green skin. That was a big part of his... It was a whole... It was a noticeable thing about his character. He was green for a reason, because of his backstory. Starfire. A lot of people debate about this. She didn't look exactly Starfire. She looked like a prostitute. Just the character. Starfire. I will kind of admit there, it doesn't look exactly Starfire, I, like, I'm not saying be exactly to the comics, fuck no, I'm just saying at least give some resemblance of alienist costume like she wore, mostly all the time. Um, for the action, it could be good, but I'm, I'm, I was a little surprised that Robin just fucking killed a bunch of people. That's something very disturbing, because I'm pretty sure Batman's like, don't you kill people. At least most of my interpretations of him. Batman's like, don't try to take people's lives, only fight to protect the people, don't kill anyone because you're better off, you're not, you're not better off. Like, wasn't that a big thing in the comics? Like, like Robin and Batman found the guy who killed Dick's parents, and he gave him a choice, do I kill him or spare him for the police? And he would leave him to the police. So that's kind of weird. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm not too sure about this, I'm 50-50, it was DC, right? DC's live action stuff have been very. Um, not the best, but not the worst. It has its moments, but. Um, its animated stuff is better, in my opinion. Just saying. CW does a good job. I'll tell you that for free. But this, is, this isn't CW, obviously. <laughs> because. Ever since Suicide Squad, it just all went down to shit, apparently. It just all went down to shit. <laughs> 
I saw a Twitter post, by the way. Arrowverse. Could, cannot say Batman for six years. Titans trailer. Fuck Batman. Fair point, it's a fair point. I mean... Hmm. I don't know, it's just... I understand they're trying to make it dark and edgy, but... It's a little too dark, if you ask me. If they could, I don't know, some shots you can really see much. Um, I can only judge from an episode, I think. It's just a little... Trailers sometimes fuck up the product, in my opinion. Like, some trailers can do it well, but some can really ruin the product. So it's only left to the premiere of the first episode, really, to see if it's good or not. Is it going to be? I don't know, I'm 50-50 on it. I can't really say for certain. I'd like it to be good, because I want DC to do good in live action. But the movies are not pr not promising me anything. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. What are you guys' thoughts on this? Does it look shit to you? Do you not like the character design? Do you just not like it in general? Do you prefer the animated stuff like I do? What's your opinions on it? Because I can't really say. I'm 50-50. I'm very 50-50 on this. It's a different interpretation. I'll leave it as that. It's a different interpretation. Just hopefully it's a good one. <laughs> to say that. Hopefully it's a good one. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Sorry I wasn't expressing much. It's just... I wasn't too sure like how to react to this. It's like... Okay. I wasn't really too sure. I'll give it a fair chance, like any show I watch, but if it doesn't if, if it doesn't suit, then I'm not going to watch it. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this. Leave your thoughts down below, and make sure to check out other stuff I do on the channel. I really appreciate it. So, see you all next time. Um, I just realized I need to make a call with someone. Uh, he might want to see this. Uh, uh, hello? Uh, Jason, is that you? Listen, I've got something you need to see. Oh, no, 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 you need to get over here right now. <laughs>